I'm Lexi Gavin Mather here. Welcome back to the channel. And today is the World Series of Poker $1,000 Mystery Millions event. Hey, Bobby boy. Hi. Hi. I live here. Yeah, do okay. you? You're, you seem to always be in the shot. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, it's flight C of the Mystery Millions, and I'm super excited. If you haven't heard, I am going to be vlogging every day of the World Series of Poker, or at least every day that I play, which is practically every day. So let's head on down to the casino and play some poker. There is a $1 million mystery bounty in this one. So one random lucky bounty winner is gonna win a million dollars. So that's really what we're chasing. But even if you don't win the bounty, first place is still around $750,000. So let's get going. I'm actually on time for once. It's very unlike me. <laughs> let's go. Why are you racing me? Pretty chandeliers. I want one in our house. No? <laughs> Bob's running away from me because he has to pee. I do. <laughs> when you get to be a certain age, and you guys out there know what age that is, like me, when you get like 30, eight, nine, 40, <laughs> somewhere around there. When you gotta go, sometimes you gotta go. Let's detain him. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> All right, I really wanna stay on the power side. I don't know if it's gonna work. For the camera. Horseshoe. What a bunch of horse poo. What a bunch of. Horse poo. Horse poo. Yeah. Three tickets, guys. You get three tickets. Don't forget a ticket. We're printing. You have to be at the horseshoe with me. We stick together. We're a team. No. We're this a is, team. Poker's not Wait, a team. You have to hit print. Poker's not Ew. a team sport. Horseshoe. Horseshoe. Oh, uh, we can make it a team sport. Let's swap 50% of each other's acts. Yeah, oh, do you I think you think might so. be a little better than me? Yeah. So you don't want to share action? Excuse Why? me, we're trying to get a ticket here. We, us too. <laughs> All right. Is this busy or what are we? Uh, low on tickets. That's great. Horseshoe. You got a horseshoe. All right, we're heading over to Horseshoe. If you get drawn Horseshoe on a day one, that means it's the overflow. So, st strategy wise. Strategy? Yeah. Is that a thing? It is, is if, you are, if you know political history. Strategically. Strategery. I have, I have strategery. So, if you're in the Horseshoe, then that means that within a few hours, could be two, could be four, could be six, depending on how busy the day is, your table will break. So that means if you have a bad table and it's a really tough table, be patient. If it has a table you're looking forward to taking advantage of and being exploitative, then do it while you can because you will break over to Paris and have a brand new table. How's that? Well said. You sir. didn't even well know said. I knew anything about poker, did you? You know, like, I know aces He, he knows kings. what the blinds are. Unless I have aces. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. Vlog bomber. Good luck. Thank you. Rest in peace, godfather of poker. Oh, show them the cafe. This is the WSMP cafe. If you get hungry and need some food, they have like prepackaged salads and sandwiches and stuff. Ooh, and it's actually nice. It's not cold in here for mm, once. Mm, it's nice. Already 2,600 players, and it's literally the start of the tournament. There's gonna be a lot more. Look who we have here, Mr. Frank Casella. Hello. Okay, this is what I was talking about. If you get a bad table draw, like you sit at your table and seat three, and you got Frank Casella <laughs> with position on you. Oh, Just are wait. you here? I'm yeah. here. Oh, babe, we're so cute. Here. My table's oh, right there. Yeah. If you're wondering who Frank is, just zoom right in there to Player of the Year uh, 2010. Don't three bet him, Frank. So be nice. Ago. Play nice. So, oh, I love that. And you were, what, 64 when that one happened? Least, you know, just when um, I thought that I was really going to miss you, now. I'm right here. Welcome to the pain train. I don't like that. I know, that's <laughs> 
Hi, honey. Hi, honey. <laughs> hey, babe. Bob. Bobby. Bobby. Hi. Because even if I don't have a straight uh, 1800. 1800. I said all in. Yeah. Yeah. 1800. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. He's asking how much you have behind oh. that there. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. What? Uh, I'm taking my thing. Oh. I don't think she had a jack either. No jack. I pulled a jack. Jealous? What a bully. <laughs> what a freaking bully. How is your stuff? My, I have three red chips. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. You, you can do it. Just visit letsygavinmather.com for my free poker training. <laughs> <laughs> she plugged her right <laughs> plug. That is awesome. It's just the husband. <laughs> Vlogosphere, this is my bestie. Hello. How are we today? Chris Birchfield, right, he's a like crusher. Everyone. Uh, last time I was on your blog, I think we were a little so bit inebriated. So, oh, so, uh, we? <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. 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 Don't drink and play, guys. No, it's no, dangerous. That's, that's, that's bad. It's dangerous. I'll do it. a good one. We're going to talk about that one on break. Like 125k at 500 big boy. All right, I had to play this one for Doyle. That's why I did that. <laughs> had to, had to. I swear I'm not that loose, guys. <laughs> okay, that was probably the first time I've ever opened 10 deuce in early position. Rest in peace, Doyle. We made it to the first break. How many chips you got, Bobby boy? 48,000. Nice. I have 115. Oh, sick brag. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's great. 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 That's just great. Yeah, thanks. 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 I know that's sincere. Okay, so we're on break, and I thought we would discuss two quick hands that were super fun. So the first hand, 200, 300, 300. I raised pocket aces under the gun to 800. Middle possession, three bets to 2200, and he was pretty tight. So I thought that he was three betting me like pretty strong. So I decided to four bet here and to 6K and he calls. The flop is ace of diamonds, jack of hearts, jack of clubs. So I flop full boat. I see bet small, I see bet uh, 2500. He raises to 7K and I just smooth call. <laughs> Uh, River is the seven, or no, sorry. The turn is the 10 of clubs. He bets again, same bet, 7K. Usually I find when people bet the same amount on like multiple streets, it's like often weak. So I decided to just call and like hope that he like continues either bluffing into me uh, or just, yeah. So, he, so the River is the seven of spades. He bets 10K. I shove all in for his like, last 6k or something and he winds up folding so i think uh yeah that was a good one that i picked up the next hand 200 400 400 cutoff raises to 1k small blind calls and i call in the big blind with king six of spades the flop is jack of spades eight of spades two of clubs he see bets 2500 and i check raise him to 70 7200 i don't have a hand that's like super strong i guess i could check call i do have the king high flush draw but i only have king six i have no pair or anything and I decided to check raise here. It's a pretty good board for my range as the big blind caller. Uh, so I check raise to 7,200. He thinks for a bit and then calls. The turn is the ace of diamonds. I bet 9,500 and he folks. So that's how we take down pots of king sixes space. We're moving to Paris. Feels like an upgrade. Here we are. What an upgrade. This is classy. Here we are. For my life. Hi. Christina Ace Jack. Yeah, what's up? Say hi to the vlog. Hey. They did the stand up. Don't scare there. me. <laughs> Sir? Very clean. Very well. <laughs> All right, on break was a pretty good 
a few levels for me. I don't even know what I have. Maybe like 170k. Sadly, Bobby Boy is no longer with us <laughs> in the tournament. Wow. <laughs> Do you know how many men in poker and around the world would be happy if you were serious about that? Oh. I'm gonna miss him, but I'm now single. Not true. And Guys, I just hope to, hope to meet someone who will travel the world with me and play poker. Hashtag more Bob in the comments. We love him. We want him to stick around. I can't yeah. play poker anymore. Uh, shout out to Ray Conner, Conner CPA, best accountant in Vegas, Especially hands down. People who gamble for a profession. Yes, yes, exactly. All right, we're gonna run to the bathroom, and then we'll talk a hand turn or the two. Camera off. Yeah, no, no, sorry. You know what? <laughs> No, I don't want to curse on the vlog, but I have a good editor that will probably you bleep curse? it out. <laughs> you curse? I've never heard that. Oh, exactly, that's right. This New York girl doesn't curse. So this is the new poker room on the horseshoe side. It's nice. All right, so let's talk a quick hand. So the blinds are 1,500, 3K, 3K. It folds to the small blind. The small blind has a lot of chips. He's like 200 something. Uh, he raises the small blind to 10,000. Hey! What's up? This is good. I, I follow this every day. They tell you what to do That's every day. Right. Follow, like, and subscribe. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> he's the best. <laughs> oh my god, that's amazing. He's a fan of mine. Yeah, he's a big fan. That's uh, Turbo. Turbo, duh. I was like, that's Turbo. Turbo. Um, anyway, so both the small blind. Small blind has like 200 something K. He raises to 10,500. I'm in the big blind with King Jack off and I call. The flop is 10, 5, 3, 2 diamonds. I have no diamonds. Uh, he checks and I check back. The turn is the queen of diamonds and now he bets out 10,500 again and I call. Um, don't love it, but I have to call, obviously. The river is the king of hearts, and now I have top pair. He bets 20,000, which was like 50% of my stack. So I thought for a little bit and I called and he had ace queen all suit for uh, a ace queen. So that was a good one. Glad that I picked that one up. And Let us know if we can walk through a louder part of the casino. It's while so distracting. I'm over people. Have I mentioned I don't like Vegas on the weekends? I used to say that all the time. I hate Vegas on the weekends. It's too many people. Look at all this. Too many people. Ugh, there and it's goes smoky. a sponsorship from the <laughs> Vegas Convention Center. Right <laughs> I'm kidding. Well, I love, love Vegas on the Friday. weekends. Oh, nice. Hi. All right. That's it. All right, all in a short time. I need a call. Hey, Sam. Thank you. Nice. I can have my combo. Got me covered? Yeah. Right on. I say, I say the combo wasn't right. reasonable. All right, well, that was nice. No making me wait. Get the fuck out of this thing, though. Okay, so that hand, he opened the button. I called for the big blind. Uh, I could have just three bet shoved pre-flop because he didn't have that much, but I just called. Um, and then he saw the flop and we hit the turn. So that was good. We have 270K at 5K big blind, so we're in good shape. <laughs> One hundred players, nine hundred and sixty-four left. All right, I am on dinner break. My first dinner break of the series. Feels good. Uh, the last level was okay. I don't have as much as I had before, but I'm still in pretty good shape. I have like 280K and we're coming back to 10K big blind. So I have 28 bigs and I do suspect that we're going to be in the money the level we come back maybe early into the next level so I just need to not punt on the bubble and you know get in there and hopefully you know my table's pretty tight so um, 
I think that I can actually kind of play a lot of hands and chip up on the bubble. I think that they kind of want to cash and uh, they've just been playing pretty tight so far. So that's it. I'm just walking around getting some steps in because when you sit so long, you got to walk. Move your butt. 808 left. 772 get paid. What do we do on the bubble? We get massage by my wifey. Wifey this power. This is Crystal, everybody. Lock is here. We're chilling. It's a big right, we're five it's people away fast. from. No, not five. Fifteen people away from the money. We're on the direct bubble. Stand up. Hold up, stand up. <laughs> I'm way too weird in these vlogs. Gotta work on that. Okay, Lex, we have like one more hand not to punt off our stack. We're not gonna punt. We're okay, Please take your seats. Yeah, do not parts deal. of it. Long Baja. Dealers, please take your seats, but do not deal. All right, guys, we're gonna start the hand for hand portion of this tournament. We're at 774 players paying 773 spots. We will take two minutes off the clock for every hand dealt. Mystery Valley players, congratulations, you have made the money. and it's because in these bounty tournaments they take a lot out of the prize pool for the bounty so let's ah. do it again tomorrow let's do it again tomorrow like and subscribe guys visit lexigavinmather.com for my free poker training see you tomorrow for groundhog day bye